Okay, before we can get into anything, we just need to check and make sure everything is right with the settings for the camera app. So let's get right into it. All right, so you can see I'm here on my iPad. I'm going to tap and open up the settings app and then scroll down on this left side until I find the camera app, which is right here. Here's camera, tap on camera, and here's a few things that we need to go over. Uh, first off is the preserve settings. Uh, this is a really interesting one because what it does is it will go back to whatever last one you were using. I'm gonna leave this off. As you can see, I leave this off so that it always goes back to shooting photos is what you, and that's how you basically want it. Unless you were some great videographer and you need it always to go back to shooting in video mode, just leave it off, okay. So now uh, this is the one that you wanna make sure is turned on, that's the grid. The grid is going to set these lines up on there that allow you to use the rule of thirds and it makes uh, beginning photography really so much easier because you can be able to follow the lines that are going to be on the camera app itself. Uh, scan Q QR codes, leave that one on. Uh, record video, mine is set at 1080 at 30 frames a second. You might wanna just uh, make sure yours is the same. Even if you can record in 4K, it's going to really, really fill up your memory on your iPad really quickly, so I would stay away from that. With the high dynamic range photos, you can see we have keep normal photos turned on. And there it is, that's the settings. And when we get into the next lesson, we're going to actually start uh, taking some photos. Thank you.